Archdiocese of the Roman Catholic Church is 125 years. President Kufado, who joined the Catholic family at the Black Star Square in Accra for the celebration, justified the decision to construct a national cathedral. <laughs> The Catholic Church in Accra began with the first Holy Mass on January 31, 1893, led by Reverend Father Otto Holbera and Eugene Reyes, two priests of the Society of African Missions who had been sent from the Aumina Mission, started in 1880. In 1947, Father Losa was appointed the first Bishop of Accra, and on February 8, 1953, he laid the cornerstone for the Holy Spirit Cathedral in Accra. Reverend Father Joseph Oliver Bowers, an African Caribbean from the Commonwealth of Dominica and the first Ghanaian Bishop of Accra, the Most Reverend Dominic Kojo Ando, continued the success story of the church. The celebration of the 125th anniversary at the Black Star Square in Accra was to thank God for keeping faith with the Catholic Church, whose membership has grown from hundreds to thousands. <laughs> The Archbishop of Cape Coast, Most Reverend Charles Gabriel Palmer Buckle, who is also the Apostolic Administrator of Accra, called on all to renew their faith and commit to a selfless service to God and mankind. Jesus Christ, the King of the Universe, teaches us not only servant kingship, he also exemplifies it in selfless service and in service even to the point of death to the point of self-sacrifice the president nana ekufu adu solicited the support of the catholic church and the entire christian community to back his administration and policies for the country's advancement i'm encouraged by the words in Ecclesiastes chapter 11, verse 4, which says, and I quote, If you wait until the wind and the weather are just right, you will never sow anything and never harvest anything. Unquote. Ghana will make it. I am confident of that. President Ekufuado indicated that the National Cathedral will be built to the glory of God. The Apostle Paul says in Philippians 4 and 13, quote, that I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. Unquote. I am firm in my view that by the grace of God and through Christ who strengthens me and my government, all the programs and policies being rolled out, which were once described as overly ambitious and not feasible by some, whether it is a free senior high school, planting for food and jobs, one district, one factory, one village, one bandana, and the development and the development of our road and rail infrastructure amongst others will be implemented to the benefit of the Ghanaian people. The execution of these policies will help lead us onto the path of progress and prosperity. And through Christ who strengthens us, the National Cathedral will be built to the glory and honor of God. Amen. The Catholic Church stands tall in the provision of social services, having built many good schools and health centers for the country.